everybody, this is our fourth video and our third attempt at recording it. I've been interrupted twice. That's okay. It's not a big deal. Anyway, here we are on Planet Tulin for the fourth video, I suppose. I mentioned that already. Anyway, we got the Silver Crown of Sahar. Finally, we got it. The thing is mine. And to prove it, I mean, I had a video filmed and reco or recorded earlier with the Hoff and everything. But the damn thing went corrupted. So, anyway, this is the best I can do right now. Here's the silver crown of Sahar. Here's the crown that I received. Now, you had to do the, the whole storyline. You end up finishing the 30, uh, the daily crafts. You get this tincture. You gotta find Safian. I think, actually, after that, you go to the Narian temple where the fountain is. You find the empty tincture bottle. It takes you to this special location with this master crafter. He takes the tincture and the silver crown, it's not the silver crown of Sahara at this point, and then puts them together and it imbues the crown with this magical crafting stuff. Anyway, that's how it gets this skill buff. So, the crown itself has a 15% skill increase bonus. With the clothing I have, I get an extra 4. So 19, but it is, see, the problem is it's only items. You don't get tools or garments. I mean, it's, I guess that could be worse, but at the same time, the amount of the work that you do for the mission, you should be able to at least craft a few things clothing and tool-wise. But at this point, I'm happy to have the crown. I'm happy to be done with the mission. I do enjoy Tulin. The community's amazing here. Really fun place to be, and I love the planet. But I think I'm a little homesick. I've used to spending a lot of time on Serene. It was my go-to planet for the longest time until the mission came out with the Renegade Plates and Rivox and I've been disgruntled. They really screwed me on a few different things. Now the Rivox mission chain has been bugged for a long time. They finally finished it. But the thing about it was after spending so much time and into it and whatnot, I'm only level 72 sniper. And like 67 damage, I believe. Uh, let's just double check those. 67 damage, 72 sniper, yep. Anyway, the gun for that mission chain is, I think, like a level 130 to level 1 whatever, level 130, and it's a BLP rifle. I mean, I'm all for getting an unlimited reward that I can use, but this one is planet bound, first of all, so you won't even be able to take it off, Cyrene, and the efficiency is horrible, and it's a skill level that I don't even know how many people can use. The mission, I think someone broke it down that it's going to take a few mil like a million, I don't even know, around a million ped just to do the damn thing. So for that amount of money, you could buy a really nice mayhem, mayhem gun that has efficiency way beyond that. So I really don't know. I don't think I'll be doing that mission, the Rivox chain, and it's really unfortunate because I did spend so much time doing it with the PvP kills. There's 5,000 regular PvP player kills that you need, and it's it's just incon It's not a fun mission chain. Like the Tulin mission was fun. I enjoyed it. However, Cyrene, that mission is not. Rivox is a dreadful mission. You also need PvP kills on the mountain. On the, uh... The Red Volcano Mountain there, where it's lootable. You can't fly a vehicle, you can't TP in. It's a pain in the ass. And people think that... And, and Cyrene devs think that people are gonna do that for a shit gun like that. Yeah, right. Yeah... I will come and get her in a second, I'm recording right now, okay? So, I am apologize for that, my son asked me to come and help him with something for a minute, so I'm going to cut the video short here in a second. I just wanted to get this out, and those are some of the rewards that I got from the mission, along with the crown, and the Hoff here, and the rare items. But... I think my time here is done on Tulin, just for a time period. I was going to do the Ancient Carpet, but the amount of drops that I've actually got is one. I've only gotten one green piece of the carpet, and I know there's people that have done it a hell of a lot more. Tulin has a lot of dedicated players, and if the carpet hasn't been created yet, then it's going to take a long time to do so. And that's okay, there's nothing wrong with that, but 
for me, I think I'm going to go try out some things on Cyrene, and uh, we'll go from there. I'll see you in my next video. Thank you. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.